Hey guys, it's Ninth here with a brand new deck profile. So for those who don't know, a brand new structure deck just came out in the OCG. This is gonna be the structure deck overlay unit. So for those who like either the rank up magic, Utopia, Utopic, Zekko theme, this is a structure deck for you. Today's profile is gonna be, it's gonna be ZW deck. So the idea is you equip these ZW monsters as equip spells to your XYZ monsters and they gain a lot of attack. With the structure deck, it came with one of these packs, which includes a new, uh, Neuron Language Utopia. If you are interested in something like this, definitely check out my eBay store. It's gonna be linked in the description. Limited quantities available. So without further ado, let's begin the profile. Starting off, we have Astral Hope. We run two of these, a brand new monster. So while you control an Xyz monster, you can special summons from your hand and you can send any other card from your hand or field to the graveyard to search for one of these cards. An Exceed Speller Trap, Automa Pia Speller Trap, Zexel Speller Trap, or Number Speller Trap. It's a really great way to kind of extend as well as search for cards in your deck. Yeah. So the little Hope guy right here. And this card's absolutely amazing. This is your normal summon. Next turn two, Zubaba. as well as to Dododo. That's gonna be for your Automatopoeia engine. Next run three of the red Zexel Servant. So while you control only one level four monster on the field, you can special summon it. And when it's used for Xyz material, you can search for a Zexel weapon monster. So being able to kind of recur the cards that you've been using for your Xyz summons. Next is the other Zexel Servant. This one here is why you control no cards on the field, you can special summon it. And when it's used as material, you can search for a rank up magic. So this one is definitely important. Next for the Zexel weapons. We're just gonna introduce all of them. Here's a brand new one. Pegasus. So you run five Zexel weapons. So this one is a basic attack booster with an effect to gain attack when your opponent activates an effect to special summons a monster. And when it, you would use a material, you can send it to the graveyard instead. This one here also attack boost and when your monster would be destroyed by effect, you can destroy it instead. On resolution, monster negate. When your monster be destroyed by battle, you can send this to the graveyard instead. And on resolution, you get a trap card. So those are the five ones you equip from the deck. For our spell and traps, we run Xyz change tactics. So every time you Xyz summon a Utopia monster, you can pay 500 and draw a card. So this allows you to really go through your deck pretty quickly and get all the necessary cards you need. Next is the Automa Pia card. This card, one card to search for two of the monsters below. Zubaba ga ga go go do do do. You can activate this to search for the Anamiya Pia cards we were talking about earlier. This one here searches for that previous card. And if you want, you can do some level manipulation with it. Run two of those. Now for our rank up magic, we run two. Zexel Force. So you can target an Xyz monster you control and rank it up either to a ZW monster or Utopia monster. And while you have 2,000 or less, if, you have, if there's a bigger difference in 2,000 life points between you and your opponent, Banish it from the graveyard, draw one card. Next, we run two Generation Force. While you control an Xyz monster, you can search for an Xyz card. Next, run two Zed Collection. Reveal a card in your hand, send it back to your deck, and search for one of these cards Zexel Weapon, Zexel Servant, Ze Zexel Spell Trap, Rank Up, or Rank Down Magic. It is a hard one to return, so you only run two of those. For one of the new cards, we run a Zexel Field. So when you activate an effect that targets an XC monster, your opponent cannot activate cards or effects in response to it. And when you XC summons a monster, you can target it, get an XC monster from your extra deck or graveyard and attach it as material. And during your draw phase, you can put Shining Draw on the top of your deck. Next is a Zexel Catapult and Zexel Entrance. This allows you a special summon from hand. This allows you a special summon from, uh, sorry, graveyard. Both searchable. Xyz export. This is also searchable. Um, you can target a monster your opponent controls. 
and equip it as material to one of your Xyz monster. And then we run double up chance, reinforcement of the army, and monster reborn. This is necessary for double, if you told me a double, generic searcher, and who doesn't love monster reborn? Next off for the extra deck, we run three copies of number 39, Utopia. This is the bread and butter of the deck. Sorry for the three artworks. I like uh, I like a lot of the artworks a lot. This is a new one right here. Next you're on one, Utopia Double. Allows you to rank up easily and be able to OTK. Number Kalos 39 here. This is really great. Uh, in tandem with the spell card earlier that lets you draw cards. Um, with that, you do not have any requirements as long as you just have a rank four. Utopia, you can rank on top of it and draw an extra card. Really amazing there. S39, I haven't summoned this recently, but it can help you when you have a lot less life than your opponent. And for the lax rank four, our new Zexal Servant. So this one, you remove two materials to special summon a Zexal weapon or a Zexal servant uh, from your deck. If your Utopia monster would be destroyed by battle card effect, you can banish this from your graveyard or field instead. So that's for our rank fours. Rank five, we have our new, brand new Lyo Hope Ray. Cover card. So these two count as Chaos number 39 in card text, so we run one of each. This one's basically a better version of the, this one. This new one here, it allows you to remove material and from your extra deck or deck, get a Zexal weapon, ZW monster, and equip it to him as if it was equipped by its own effect. And while it's equipped with a Zexal weapon, you can target a card your monster opponent controls, negates effect, and cuts attack in half. This one here requires targeting in order to be able to equip from other places with its own effect, so not as good. Chaos 39, Hope Ray V. Hope Ray winning. And S39, Lightning. Just great cards I have in Utopia deck. There are circumstances where you need to summon them, especially Lightning. And for the rest of our rank fives, we have two Zexal weapon, one old and one new. This lets you search for a Zexal weapon from deck to hand. And this lets you search for a Zexal spell or trap card from your deck. And each of them allow you to equip themselves to a Utopia Xyz monster and it gains 3000 attack. So you can summon, search, equip, that monster gains 3000 attack. And for our last, Xyz monster is going to be number 99. So while this isn't the most competitive build, it's definitely a lot of fun being able to OTK your opponent with a Utopia monster equipped with multiple Zexal weapons. It's not that rare for the deck to actually uh, end with a Lyle Hope Ray, as well as two or three equipped Zexal weapons, which allow you to easily have game. We don't run the new number 99 or the hyper rank up magic just because it isn't really meant for the Zexa weapon, but probably for the most competitive build, this is great because it allows you to tutor out any of your number monsters. What do you guys think? If you want to see more content like this, let me know. Take care guys, peace. <laughs>